Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Star Wars Coffee. Where in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at an interesting thing that Amelia Clark said about Solo and Kira. That's today here on Star Wars Coffee. Kira, despite her youth, is Dryden Voss's most trusted lieutenant, or should we say, was, and is an increasingly important Crimson Dawn operative and even more so after the events of Solo. She has risen far above the bleak conditions of her youth on Corellia, which we saw at the beginning of the film, where she lived in the sewers with the notorious White Worms gang, as well as on Solo. So up to this point, that is really what we know about Kira's backstory. Now it's interesting that Kira has made her return in a comic book, but nothing has been set in stone for live action. We know that when Solo was originally developed, it was supposed to be a trilogy, with Alden Ehrenreich originally having a three-film contract. Will that translate to a Disney Plus series? Will that translate to another film exclusively on Disney Plus in the Star Wars world? That remains to be seen. However, Amelia Clark is very interested in continuing the story that she started with Kira. She told the HollywoodReporter.com that she would love to play Kira again, saying the following. Clark is also looking back at 2018 Solo, a Star Wars story, which trended last month on its three-year anniversary as part of an effort by fans to see that story continue. But as much as she'd love to return to the role of Kira, Clark has yet to hear anything about a possible Disney Plus future for her fan favorite character. She's the one that has the most unfinished business, Clark explains. I really had pages about what her life was and what it would be afterwards. But I'm afraid I've heard nothing of Disney Plus being the case. So maybe I'll just write it and send it to them. I'll be like, hey guys, I've got a few ideas. Well, that is very interesting. So she knows a lot more about the character than what we know, considering this was supposed to be a three film project. After it ended up having the director changes and then having to bring Ron Howard in and having to do reshoots, this film ended up barely making any money, if any, by the time all of that was taken care of. Had it just been Ron Howard the whole time, the film probably would have been quite profitable, but that wasn't the case and therefore a solo sequel has been stalled. Now obviously this could be one of the times where we have seen actors playing coy. Joel Edgerton as well as Ewan McGregor talking about Obi-Wan Kenobi prior to its official announcement refused to say that the project was in development even though they would continually hint at it by talking about how much they would like to return to play the characters. Could Amelia Clark be doing the exact same thing here? This sounds very simple to me. Yes. I would say that there is definitely enough of a desire for the show to continue that this would end up being in development, especially since we know that there is already a Lando story in development with Donald Glover. It would only seem to make sense that Kira might at least make an appearance in this since she knew Kira, since he knew Kira before Solo. This leads for me to question whether or not we'll ever see Alden Ehrenreich again or whether we'll see Solo continue in a series. Personally, I'd rather see a solo series continued rather than a Lando one, but I will be happy to see that storyline continue either way. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section down below. Thank you guys for watching, may God bless you, and the Force be with you always. If you enjoyed this episode, and frankly, even if you didn't, don't forget to subscribe. Do it! And if you want to help spread the word, please give this video a thumbs up and tell your friends to subscribe. Please check out the official Star Wars Coffee merchandise, and don't forget to check out all of the content playlists on this channel, including The Rise of Skywalker, The Mandalorian, and much more.